So it is 2 a.m. It's Sunday already. And I just got the email that from 23andMe saying that they got my results already. Yay! I'm excited. They finally got my aunt's results. My aunt's DNA. And it took two weeks for them to say that. So I delivered my kid on the 15th on a Monday. And it took a whole fucking week for it to get there. I live an hour away. The place is an hour away. How are you going to take a fucking week to get there? It doesn't make sense to me. I already ranted about this, so I'm not going to rant about it again. And so yeah, it arrived there on the 20th. And today's the 27th, I think. 26th. Uh, 27th, actually. And... I just got the email saying that it arrived. Okay, what the fuck? Was it outside? You know what I mean? It rained yesterday. It got probably wet. <laughs> no, I know, no, I know. I'm just... I know it was not in the rain. It was probably in their office. But they, they barely had time to analyze it right now. Because they're probably busy. They have a lot of kids. I know, I know I get that part. But I just... I just liked it before, how it was before. Where they don't tell you there's not these all these steps. Because all these steps is like... The steps don't make sense. They say it takes three days for it to be delivered and for it for them to say that you got they receive your results. It did not take two, three days. It took two weeks for them to say all this stuff. So I'm very stressed and it, this makes me paranoid. So I prefer not to know anything about it. I just prefer to wait the four weeks. <laughs> yeah, I would try to do a like an update well this is an update but this is i would try to do like a live view so y'all could see her results if anyone was interested in well the health results come in first so i will try to do the health research health results first because you get your trades your um your health tools i mean i think it's named health tools and then it says has many names for it So I would try to do that. I would try. I don't know if I would do it. And I wonder if... I want to know what the difference is between her and my mom. Because I don't know. Is, you know what I mean? It, there's no... There's not a... Uh, there's not really... There's no difference between brothers and sisters sometimes. My brother and I... We've tested with 23 me and... Our results are... Similar. Exactly, kind of. Actually, no, they're a little bit different, but I mean, they're still similar, everything. The health results, the ancestry results, were similar. So, we'll see how that turns out. And if anyone is interested in the update... Tell me if you're interested in it, or if you're not, or if you want me to show a particular thing, like the traits, something about the traits, or something about the blood type, if you want to know the blood type, or the HAPA group, if anyone's interested in knowing the HAPA group, because the HAPA group comes in with the health results, I think, it should come in with the health results. I mean, I don't know the HAPA group, but I already know what her HAPA group is. I, I also could say, um, oh no, do the, no, the, um, oh, and then, um, I wonder, I think, um, the genealogy, genealogy, genealogical results come in at last, so they come after the, the ancestry results, so, I could also share the, the genealogical results with yeah because like I said my cousin and I are related about 14% so a cousin is usually isn't a cousin um something isn't 12 the the average so 14 is a little bit high it's 13.999 I think I'm not sure So I don't know how we could be, f I mean, my brother and her, all my relatives with my cousin, we have, um, they, their DNA is average, but
but only with me, my cousin and I. It's a little bit high. I mean, I consider it high. I don't know why. Because it's not between the average, but... There's people that have gotten um, 17%. They share DNA. They share 17%. I don't know. What the fuck? I wonder if they're double cousins. They're, they're married cousins within cousins. Because it's common, right? I mean, I've explained the whole cousin thingy before. It's common in my family. It's common in a bunch of families. Where you marry your... Well, not your cousin, cousin, but your cousin's... Co Cousin, yeah, cousin, distant cousin, second cousin, third cousin, first cousin once removed, first cousin twice removed, you marry your, like that. Okay, so I'm already babbling and talking about gibberish, and goodbye.